What do you get when you mix a passion for finding a breast cancer cure, six tribute bands, and an all natural crowd? Well, you get Nudapalooza. Hosted by Cypress Cove Nudist Resort in Kissimmee, Florida, Nudapalooza is an all-day charity concert that has raised hundreds of thousands of dollars for cancer research in its history. The event was open to the public and featured six tribute bands with acts that honored such famous sounds as Dean Martin, Lincoln Park, Dolly Parton, and Hart, among others. This was a great day to come together, enjoy some great people, and help out the fight against breast cancer. The music mix was very eclectic, so you would have a pretty hard time not finding something you like. Not to mention, live music is always good. There were food and soft drinks available at the venue, as well as beer and a pretty well-stocked outdoor bar. And if you wanted to give more than the entry fee, there was a raffle held with the proceeds going to charity, and they had some pretty amazing prizes there. Uh, after the concert concluded, there was an after-party pool party hosted by DJ Dave. You know, he's kind of a famous name among the Cypress Cove community. What more could you want? Well, funny you ask. Well, on top of all this, the entry fee for the concert also gave you a day pass to the resort where you could enjoy all the amenities there, such as the pool, uh, hot tubs, uh, watercraft, pitch and putt golf, pickleball, and baton. All in your natural self if you so chose. There was a mix of dressed and bear attendees at the event uh, with the bear winning out by a large margin. Uh, tickets for the event, they, they sold for $45 for the early birds with the price you know get, getting higher and higher as you got closer to the event. Cypress Cove has been the premier family-friendly close free vacation destination in Florida for visitors around the world. Conveniently located in Central Florida with all the Orlando attractions nearby, the 300-acre family-owned resort boasts 84 villa hotel rooms and apartments, a modern RV park, campsites, a 50-acre lake for water sports, two sparkling pools, and all the amenities that I talked about above. Uh, while this sounds very much like an advertisement, I did want to plug this place. It is one of the nicest, nudist-friendly resorts I've ever been to. If you want to check out this place, Sometimes other than Nudapalooza, there's weekly entertainment, there are themed weekends, uh, special annual events uh, such as the, the Nudapalooza and the uh, Parrot Head uh, Charity Weekend. Uh, go check them out at, at cypresscoveresort.com for more information. It's definitely worth the trip. Uh, now into my experience. Well, I, I went there, I met up with a few friends and made several new ones along the way. And even though this is a generalization, I gotta say it's my opinion that nudists are some of the most friendly people you'd ever wanna meet. Uh, there was a good process to get from the gate to the event parking. Uh, the live music was very enjoyable and the food at the concert, well, it, it was a picnic variety. It was okay, burgers, hot dogs, things like that. Uh, if you wanted a more sophisticated meal, you could always check out the Cheeks restaurant, which was right across the street by the pool. Uh, the weather was cool, which was a blessing being in Florida, but not enough to make us want to put on more clothes. We did have a very short bit of cold rain, but it passed quickly and didn't really dampen the energy of the event. Uh, and the breeze really helped keep us comfortable as shades in short supply uh, at the sunning yard. Uh, all in all, it was a great time, as well as a good exploration of a place I have been meaning to get to, but just haven't got around to it yet. Uh, the event itself was well run by the friendly staff. Uh, the, hats off to them. Herding cats at both the event and the parking areas. They kept things running smoothly and they did it in a friendly fashion. So in my opinion, it was a stellar event and it whetted my appetite to come back, uh, you know, sometime other than Nudapalooza when I could see kind of what, what normal life was at the Cove. Nudapalooza comes around every October, so check it out if you'd like to attend a fun bear event at the same time help out the fight against breast cancer. Hopefully I'll see you on the grounds of the Cove. Oh, and don't forget the sunscreen. Uh, pitch and Putch, Pitch and Putch. Hosted by Cypress Garden, wait, Pitch and Putch, the, the, the time help out against the... Uh,